Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of me playing Turnip Boy Rob's Bank. And in the last episode we have defeated our first boss, Yeehaw, even though Dilitini doesn't really seem to remember it. So we'll see what uh, that is about. <laughs> and we've got our first better weapon by trading in those trashy weapons that we find along the way, like the fish and the cactus. So without any further ado, let's jump straight back in and let's go. Yo. Okay, and we're back. And I have played a good while without recording. <laughs> Not too much has happened. We have found a camp uh, in the bank. I'm sure I'll have to go back and forth so you'll see the path that I took then. And I also um, managed to tag all the paintings that Pease asked me for in the last episode. And what did that do? It gave me a hat. And then we found Cran Cran's grandchild that makes me or that that would like me to bring something to Cran Cran on the other side. Okay, anyways, holo Annie. It makes sense. Stinky has added so many rooms to this bank that it's starting to get hard to traverse in a timely manner. Just buy a ticket through the app or kiosk and exit the bank from any station. Oh, that's good. We get stations. Purchase ticket. Really good. I'll show you what I've got from Cran Cran's child, uh, grandchild. It's this manhwa. I reincarnated into a fantasy world as an alien worm from outer space. So that's what we have to bring Cran Cran. And this is kind of, what's it called again? Let me see real quick. This is what we found, the center courtyard from here with our brand new green key card we got into this place. There were a few graves and stuff, and this is uh, toxic waste that hurts us, as uh, as we could see there. <laughs> and now we're at the seed stock, so I hope uh, you're you know what's up now. <laughs> okay, well, let's see. Get some stuff here. That's our new weapon. We're in danger. We okay. Well, let me talk to these people first, please, police. <laughs> Look, I know what you're thinking. I get it. My friend here. He's ugly. <laughs> Who cares, bro? Get over it. I wish I could tell him he's ugly, but he's new here, okay? What am I supposed to say? You look gross? Uncanny? Nah, bro, I can't do it. You can't make me. He's just going to have to find out on his own. Oh my god. Can I just talk to you? Please, kiwi! A blue kiwi slice. Okay, hello, fellow food folk. How are you this fine food folk day? Well, I'm trying to escape right now, but I wanted to talk to you first. Okay, that's it. Cool. That's what I stayed here for. Okay. Um. Wait. Where's my way back? Can I just get the ticket thing? Where was that? Here. Oh my god. Can I just buy a ticket, please? Yes. Can I just go? Thank you. <laughs> oh my god. Okay. Ooh. Ooh. Found a lot of money. I didn't even pay attention to that. Okay. Dilidini wants to talk to us. You see some familiar faces turn up head. Get any good intel? This whole thing is much more than I anticipated, Rookie. We gotta step it up. No, you gotta step it up. Keep exploring the seed stock to see how we can move forward. There's gotta be a way to get deeper into the bank. Chop chop. Okay, well, we've got some money. Does any of this help us? Adds an additional minute to the timer. And it's so expensive that I must think that it does that permanently, so let's see, I guess, <laughs> and hope for the best. Here we are, and we have four minutes now. Okay, let's head straight back into the seed stock, which is this way. Here we are. Worms are not friends. <laughs> Here's Mac. So, no, you're not a camper. I'm so sick of all these people who think they're campers. No, you're not. Most of you aren't even close to being campers. I see these people saying, I put well over 100 hours into camping and it's great. That's nothing. Most of us can easily put 300 plus hours into camping. I see people who only have their backpack and claim to be campers. Come talk to me when you pick up a sweet scent like mine and then we can be friends. Sincerely, all of the actual campers. Okay. <laughs> nice. Ooh, police! Why are there so many? Okay. Uh, elevator on fire? Is that what that means? 
I hear uh, the Cran Gallica. My grandmother was a big inspiration for me to get into drawing. She was quite the artist. Now I have trauma because of you. Maybe this will fuel me as an artist? Look, just go and give her the manoir. It's the, it's the least you can do for sending her to the other side. Okay, well... I guess we'll go into the elevator in a second. Ooh, carrot. Ah, yes, a new visitor. I've been waiting for someone new to join my movement for a long while now. It's been so long since I've seen a new face. Oh, what's that? You don't have yourself a cardboard box? I'm afraid I can't let you in without one, my sweet child. <laughs> Once you have opened your mind, body and soul in acceptance of our rectangular overlords, I will allow you to pass. Buy a cardboard box from the dark web. Okay, will do, I guess. Okay, what's down here? Ooh, who are you? Plum. Zoe, the crime rate has been rising fast in these parts, I'll tell you what. First there was talks of tax evading, then that no good grapefruit and their war. And now we've got a good old classic bank robbery on our hands. Gosh darn tootin' my me wa and peepa <laughs> would be turning in their graves. I'm glad I got to meet the legend in the flesh. I tip my hat to you, sir. I'll be telling the young'uns the tales of Turner Boy for days to come. Oh, thank you. Wow, there's a lot of people here. Is that a poetry slam going on there? We'll see. Hey man, I'm a little bummed out because my good old friend who used to live in the red tent here moved away. He was one of my best friends, man. Hopefully I can find him on flip-flop. <laughs> I think these cultists are going to drop the property values around here. I don't know if it's going to be filled anytime soon. Oh! I just wanted to talk to you, I'm sorry. <laughs> Carrot? <laughs> Hello, I'm being enthusiastic and likable. He now can trust me. Okay, Carrot. Old Man Lemon! Turn a boy! I found you, kid! I took shelter here with the other Vegeville inhabitants when the war was coming to an end. You can't startle me like that, kid. You run off and all that of a sudden I'm hearing rumors that you're doing a job with a pickled gang. Isn't that a hoot? Wait, you're kidding, right? Kid, what would your father think? Are you doing a heist here? Oh, this is bad. This is really bad. Sorry, Old Man Lemon. Ooh, I can shake a lot of people here. <laughs> come one, come all, gather round to hear the good word about the great mush. Okay, maybe later. Oh, hi, turnip boy. You haven't happened to see an acorn around here? I actually have. They haven't made their loan payment and it's due today. The market's been kind of shaky after you know who died and you know the war. Could you bring this to them if you see them? Congratulations. Okay, it's also laminated. They're learning. <laughs> can't rip it up <laughs> okay i will deliver that uh, at some point whoa tb it's been so long i'm glad you got out of the war life we barely made it out ourselves it's a good thing we landed here safe and sound oh yeah the florist and i share a tent now mm -hmm. i know i know some people think we're moving too fast but it's already been two days why wait you may have ripped my love letter to her but i do thank you for connecting us you're a real cupid you're welcome the florist. Turn a boy, oh my mush, you're alive. This is great news because I need help. <laughs> Look, I feel pretty dumb. I should have made a move a lot sooner with Strawberry. With everything that has gone on, I feel like we need to make the series quick. I read some old world text and they used to give each other rings to show how much they love each other. Materialism at its finest. Could you help me find a ring so I can propose to Strawberry? We've already moved around so much. I want to make sure that she knows I'm in this for the long haul. Oh, it needs to have a big gem on it. Massive. The bigger it is, the more I love her. That's how it works, turn a boy. Is it? <laughs> Find a candy ring for the florist, Blueberry. Okay. Well, I know I said I wanted to go into the elevator, but now I'm here. Oh, Yeehaw is still with us. <laughs> Okay, look, partner, contractually, I'm set. My contract says I gotta fight you at least one time, only once. Other than that, I'm napping. If you provoke me again, turnip, I'll go to kitty mode. Try me, turnip. I have one and a half minutes, let's try it. All right, turnip, you asked for it, you want to disturb my nap, hmm? Yes, let's go, yeehaw. Oop, oh no. Don't know if this weapon is really for me. The troops don't believe me. The goblins are real, okay? Ooh. Money back too small. Come to Roboroids for some... Okay, now I can hold two and a half grand. 
Okay, second stage. Old Stinky has hired us to keep this here bank and its secret safe. Get him, boys. Yeehaw. Okay. Oh, God. Stinky is at it again. Eh, uh, not Stinky. Yeehaw. <laughs> oh, God. I should probably watch my hearts. But I'm not really that good at that. Can I please get a heart? Oh, my God. He's saying something, but I can't even look. <laughs> okay, so it is third stage. All right, cowboy. I'm giving you one last shot to to surrender here, so drop your gun and stick your hands up. Wait, we don't have hands. Okay. Oh god. I didn't make it. Oh. <gasps> I lost so much money. Okay, never mind. We can go in again. It's fine. Ooh, I have to dodge a little bit more, I guess. I'm not great at dodging him, and I am not great at attacking him, so that's a great round. Okay, second round. Oh <laughs> god. Oh god. Um, there's a heart though. Oh boy. Third stage again. Let's go. Oh my good yo. Help, help, help. Can I please get a heart? Oh my god. Thank you. Kind of, I guess. Okay, he's nearly, he's nearly over. He's nearly over. Oh my god. <laughs> good. I've yeet my last, my last haul. <laughs> Again, that is the weapon I got now. Nice. <gasps> can I get in here? Oh my god. Ah, oh, that's the way back. <laughs> Good thing I can get in there. Well, I can get in here. Where am I? Oh, I'm here. Wait, that is the same room. No wonder the boss, boss fight kind of triggered again. Because it's the exact same room. Okay, well, I guess we'll go up and we will actually um, use that elevator now. The one that looked like it was on fire for some reason. This one here. Money back too small. No, well, let's go up here. Hello. The f okay, okay. We're at the office space again. That's cool. It doesn't even make any sense because I can't hold any more money. So I guess I'll just leave because what's the point? This one, however, we have two more minutes. What could go wrong? Oh god. Where am I? Day one of working here? These cults weirdos approached me about joining their little community. They kept on asking me to do things for them, and the Great Mush would grant me all I could ever desire. What more is there to life than standing here and waiting for folks to break this elevator? I'm kidding. Okay, well, Mushroom Cultist, this is a close community. Get lost, freak. Unless you have a certain something to say, you won't be allowed in. Look, if you're that serious about getting in, go talk to one of our recruiters down by the seed stock. They'll have plenty of information about a prospering community. May mush be with you always. Okay. Okay, here we go. What's the money situation like? Two and a half grand plus all the things. Oh my god. Yes, all the money. Nice. Okay, so dark web. I need a cardboard box for 8k. <gasps> oh my what okay well increases money boy turnip can hold 12 and a half grand <laughs> bullets do more damage with the steroids <laughs> let's get that i guess redling gun let's go Ooh, we got a shotgun nice <laughs> Ooh, that's actually great for me because I am really bad at aiming. <laughs> so uh, let's head back in there. So where are we going now? Because we cannot afford an... Ooh, that was a one hit as well. Because we cannot afford... Oh my god, a cardboard box yet. So we're just in here trying to get money. I guess the best thing to do would be to go back to the boss then. Because I think that gave us a lot of money. So let's just do that. Uh, speedrun style. <laughs>Okay, never mind. We'll try um, by just robbing the bank normally. Okay, I should probably find the acorn because they wanted me to talk to the acorn as well. And that is down here. There we go. Hey, turnip. Why are you on my land? Um, I don't have money. Here, take my scalp and tears. <laughs> oh my god. I, 
I'm not sure if they just filled this or if they had it on standby. I'm not sure if they just filled it or had it on standby. Okay. Wow, I'm I am in pain, but I have real estate. Oh god. Bring the payment to the real estate blueberry. Okay, I shall. Ooh, a golden block for 500. Nice. Um let's switch it up like that. Okay, three more minutes. Now, where was that blueberry lady? Where is she? Down here to the right. Yeah, there we go. Oh, what's all this? This is all they had? Why did they give you their hat headpiece skull? They called it their scalp? I can't keep doing this. <laughs> you know what, turnip boy? Keep the scalp. Guess I'll just take the tears <laughs> for your work. Take the small token of my appreciation. Whoa, I found rock house. Why is this wet? Okay. Thank you. <laughs> okay, let's shake up a few more people here. Get a little bit more money. Oh, hello. You must be here to learn more about the great Mush, the creator of all folk, folk, food folk life. We have an incredible community of believers who dedicate their lives to the great Mush. Are you sure you're up to snuff? Wait, you've got the glow. You must be blessed by the great mush. Here, take our passcode. This should help. Rejoice, our chosen one is here. Congratulations. The glyphs aren't dis discernible, but it looks interesting. Okay, but what about the cardboard box? Is that a different cult? Or is that just um, a different way to get in? Or I don't know. I guess we'll see. Okay, and now we just have to hope for one of the elevators up here to bring us to that cultist entrance again. This one doesn't look like it does it. Wait, did we not have two different elevators? What about if I go up and then come down again? Okay, where are we? I actually do not know. Old Lady Lime! Hey there, sweet pea. Have you seen my hobby? His memory ain't what it used to be. He said he was gonna be here hours ago. This visit meant so much to me, mostly because he has our divorce papers. Could you find him and get them for me, hon? Okay, well, I kind of... Homewrecker. <laughs> no. Right, I need to find that other entrance. I'm sorry, love. But where... Is it this one? The fire hazard one? I don't really think so. I mean, it looks weird. Ayo, what's poppin' flip floppers? DJ Sizzle, give it up for DJ Sizzle. Thanks for bringing the life to the party. Take my pa patent and soul sampler, yo. You can slash up those ungnarly falls and trade me their souls for some sick beats. I'm only giving you the scythe once as a special DJ Sizzle promotion. After that, you gotta hit up the music box for some soul stealing weapons. You're looking for some more fun? How about using some extra souls on the mystery box? You may get lucky with some crazy weapons. What? <laughs> Sell your soul, harvest five souls. Okay. I guess I'll do that after. Will I keep that one soul? I guess that is going to be interesting to know. I should probably take the train home because, um, because that's what happened. Purchase ticket. Thank you. Please let me go. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> okay. Nice. Wait, is that enough for the cardboard box? Or was it 12 grand or something? Eight grand, just so cardboard box. Here we go. <laughs> let, the, let the carrot appraise your cardboard box. Okay, I'm gonna give... Oh, close. Okay. Okay, and I'm going to try to find some souls in the next episode. Uh, how about that? <laughs> and I'll probably get into the cult and we'll see what it's all about. The Great Mush. Will we see the Great Mush? We'll see, I guess, maybe in the next episode. So thank you so much for watching this video. Make sure to like it and subscribe to the channel. And I'll see you in the next episode. Bye.